welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com in this video we have a new Windows 10 build to look at this is 18214 and this is for Windows Insiders on the skip ahead so this is a 19H1 build not Redstone 5 we're past Redstone 5 and we're on this build now now there's not a huge amount of changes at this stage because they've really just started out on this build which is not due till the first half of next year um, so things like the visual look and feel and everything is all very similar. What Microsoft said in the release notes is your phone is working and I have demonstrated this in a previous video where you can fire up your phone and then you can see photos here from um, my Android phone so I can then edit those and work on those. At the moment it just does phone uh, pictures but you see you have got this option of um, messaging but the uh, UI is there, but nothing is sort of linked to it yet. So there's no uh, changes to the app just yet, but that's coming soon. The only other changes are um, compatibility with HTTP, HTTP2 and Cubic, which is part of the security system of Windows Server 2019. The rest of the changes are sort of minor improvements and fixes. Uh, things like the clock flyout has been fixed, some safe mode issues have been fixed, some timeline issue, issues have been fixed and um, they've made a slight change to the snipping tool which is telling you how it's being moved to a new home to Green Sketch. Um, I use snipping tool a lot so it's good to see that that um, message is, is there. This is Screen Sketch and you can see this in my previous build so this is a new way of capturing images with um, the snipping tool, like a new version of the snipping tool. There's still some issues um, with dark theme. Uh, there's a, still a couple of issues with sort of the ease of access, Windows 10s and Narrator. They have fixed the well, Windows Mixed Reality issues with this build as well so things like controller pairing has been fixed but really I'm afraid that is all that's in with this new build uh, early days yeah all the features tend to come once they've sort of got this stabilized so I guess a couple of months then we'll start seeing new features coming through uh, that's when it gets a bit more uh, a few more bugs in and then it stabilizes again ready for release so that's 18214 Windows Insiders on the fast ring